Hey guys, Matt here from Become Elite and welcome to another Two Minute Tuesday. In case you're not aware, FG boots look like this and they're meant to play on normal grass surfaces that are not very muddy or slippery. And AG boots look like this and they're meant to play on turf fields. However, when you look at pros that play on artificial turf fields, they never wear these AG boots. They always wear the FG boots, the firm ground boots. So why do they wear these firm ground boots on artificial turf when there's a whole section, a whole category of these AG boots that are available to them. Well, let's put the time on the screen and let's get started. So back in 1965, a new type of artificial grass was patented in and started to gain popularity after its use in the Houston Astrodome. Because of this, it started to be known as AstroTurf. AstroTurf was rough to the touch, unforgiving, and rock hard. This artificial turf was like playing on a rough carpet over cement. Playing on this type of turf with FG boots was a terrible idea. It was painful, it was super hard on your knees, ankles, and joints, and it was very slippery. It was for this specific type of turf that AG boots or artificial ground boots were created. Then in the early 2000s, a new type of turf was created. This turf was called field turf. Field turf better replicated real grass. It was spongier, it was lighter, it was thicker, and it was longer than AstroTurf. Field turf is what is now found in most artificial fields around the world and is the only type of turf that is found in the MLS stadiums or USL stadiums today. And since this new turf better replicated grass, most professionals preferred to wear FG boots on this new type of grass. Since the ground was spongier, there was no need to have that flatter sole plate. And since the grass or the actual turf blades were longer and thicker, you needed more traction than the AG boots could provide. Now it's not foolproof. There is still some inherent danger to wearing the FG boots even on this new field turf. And although it's not as dangerous as on AstroTurf, it's still more dangerous to wear FG boots on artificial turf fields than it is on grass. This is because you can grip this turf too much and risk spraining an ankle or a knee during this time, which I've done before. However, this risk on field turf is just slightly more compared to real grass. And so when pros are deciding on which boots to wear, they'd rather take that slightly more risk but gain so much more traction with the FG boots than wearing the AG boots and having a little bit safer boot on their foot but losing all that traction and change the direction of your speed. They sacrifice that tiny bit of safety to gain so much more traction. And that's the exact reason why in my videos, my team training sessions, my individual training sessions, and my games, I wear firm ground sole plate boots on artificial turf fields. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. How to do on time. Oh!